Hello guys. So um, today what I'm going to do is have a quick chat about this software that I'm writing, the Windows software. Um, and what it's going to do is it's going to work out uh, which debt I should pay off first. Um, so what you would do is you would start by typing in a debt number. Then you would select if it's a priority or a, a non-priority debt. Uh, then you'd put in the original, original amount borrowed the interest charge, um, the system will then work out how much interest um, you've been charged or you can put this in yourself, then the total amount payable, over what period in months, um, how much you're going to pay each month, uh, it's going to work out the, it's going to be like a, an, an ongoing thing, an outstanding balance and this extra money will be if you've got say, let's just say 50 quid a month extra at the end of the month you, you should be able to use it to pay off towards the debt if that makes sense um so i'm going to start it off with just so you can just enter two debts first of all um and it'll tell you out of them two obviously after you've saved both two debts then there'll be something on this side it'll give you a summary and you and you click a button that says something like um, which do I pay off first so you click the button it'll do all the calculations and it'll say I recommend you pay off um, let's just say for instance that one first over let's just say for instance that one first if that makes sense bank loan um, anyway um, so I want some comments please um, because there are suggestions that you pay off um, a prior par, uh, priority debt first and a priority debt is such things as child maintenance, court fines, council tax, electric gas, HMRC, mortgage, rent, believe it or not, TV license, VAT. Whereas a non-priority debt is stuff like bank loans, overdrafts, catalogues, credit cards, store cards, if you borrowed money from family or friends, your mobile phone, water bill, etc. Uh, now, the reason a water bill is in a non-priority debt, but a gas and electric bill is, is the fact that, apparently, from what I've heard, the water companies cannot cut your water off, whereas the gas and electric companies can cut your utility off. Um, so, let me know how it goes. Let me, let, let me know what you think. Um, I'm I'm pretty I'm guessing that nearly everybody who's watching this video has more than one debt, um, and sometimes you must think, bloody hell, if I pay off this one, I'm going to have no money for this one and such and such, um, and stuff like that. Now again, some say pay off the one where where you're paying the most interest. Some say pay off the one that's got the least amount where you are. Some say pay off the one where there's like literally only a few more payments to go, etc. What are your thoughts on this? Um, my personal thoughts are pay off the one where you owe the amount, the least amount first, followed secondly by the ones where you have got the least minimum payments first. Um, because if you pay off, let's just say you've got three three bank loans and you owe 60 quid on one, 600 on the other, or 6,000 on the other, it's obvious you, you're going to pay off the six, the, the one where you owe 60 pound first. So then you're just left with two debts, aren't you? One, two bank loans, one with 600 pound and one with 6,000. Um, now, if, for instance, you owe the one 600 that's, that's got... Um, 5% APR, but the 6,000 one is 14%, I would still be inclined to pay the £600 off one first, because once you've paid it off, then you're only left with one debt. And the other thing is, the payments you've been paying for the £600 one, let's just say that's, for example, 100 quid a month, could you not use that £100 a month then to go towards the last loan so instead of paying 200 pounds a month for the last loan you'd pay 300 pound a month if that makes sense 
it's, it's quite complicated, but let us know what you think anyway, guys.